setting up the PIR sensor on the PAR UR2 controller. So here's the PIR sensor on the PAR UR2 controller, and we're going to use this for applications where we don't have a constant occupancy, such as meeting rooms. So the idea being, as somebody comes into the room, the air conditioning unit comes on. Once the area is no longer occupied, we'll no longer be air conditioning the area. So select menu, scroll down to settings, accept the default password of four zeros, and we select energy saving. On here we can specify what we want to have happen with the PIL sensor. So we set the moment for 15 minutes. So every time we monitor movement in the room, the air conditioning unit runs for a further 15 minutes. We've got further options on here. And these are to do with setting up when the PIL sensor actually works. So day and time, we'll specify, say, hours between 9 to 5 that the PIL sensor works, or we can use the brightness sensor. So if the lights are in the room and somebody's in the room, then the air conditioning unit comes on. When you're happy with that, press the close button. And one other thing we need to do is scroll down to lock operation, and we need to lock the on-off button. The reason we're doing this is we're making the PIR sensor make the decision about when the air conditioning unit's on or off. Therefore, we need to prohibit operation of the on-off button. Once we're done, come back out, back onto the home screen, and you'll see the on-off button is now prohibited.